Hi, my name is Nathan Duckworth, and these are my audience members. Um, my speech is over technology changing our culture. My main points will be emotionless online communication, interpretation of text, technology creating its own culture. I feel like as I've gotten older, technology has not only changed me, but people across the world. In just a short years that the internet has existed, it has changed the way that human beings function. We have pretty much all the information in the world at the touch of our fingertips. Most of us literally only have to move a couple of fingers on our smartphone to figure out anything we want. Think of the way schools are ran without this technology. Kids actually had to read a book to gain knowledge before the internet was even invented. We use the internet very much to our advantage, but some of the stuff we read is not necessarily reliable. Not everything in the media is real, but most people believe what they read. Through technology, we lose a lot of emotion and a lot of thoughtfulness in our text. This leads to a harder translation of the text because there is no, really, no body movement to interpret. Technology is changing our personal human connections and creates a big illusion of relationship while simultaneously benefiting us with quick access to social media and information. For my online, emotionless online communications, feelings, feelings, thoughts, and ideas are stripped away. So it leaves communication almost emotionless. And it's, it, the ability is to easily be taken away out of conversations and it strips away from our day-to-day, face-to-face conversations. In an article called Does Technology Impact Our Culture by Sandra on January 29, 2013, it examines the outcome of technology on a person's cognitive abilities. Sandra states that people often send messages electronically but it is because it is harder to discuss difficult issues face-to-face. Through technology, feelings, thoughts, and ideas are eradicated from people's discussions. People who use technology can always be heard and never feel alone, but they are under the illusion of companionship rather than friendship. People are starting to take the easy way out because it is so easy to do so through technology. People do not have to participate in hard conversations anymore because they can just shoot a quick text. People are losing the common conversation skills due to the lack of feelings and deep thoughts. This can lead to isolation of people by not giving enough time towards the other person's thoughts and ideas. For my other main point, 